Warning. A very good friend of mine told me something the other day. I'd like to pass it on to you because I believe that what he said to be true. He said, we're here for a good time, not a long time. So have a good time. The sun can't shine every day. If you do not find this video entertaining, then you are taking life way too seriously. If you have a complaint about any episode, please book an appointment with the therapist. Cheers, dudes. What are you doing here, man? What? <laughs> it's vacation week. We told you it's vacation week. Why are you set up already? Look, everything's already set up. It's, wait, are Kay. you rolling? Yeah, he is. <laughs> oh man. Okay, right, okay, we gotta talk. So, that dude. That's dude. Welcome to, to our vacation. <laughs> yeah, this isn't really lazy boys night. This is more of a, a vacation interrupt us. Okay, dude. To keep things simple, because it is your vacation, you have seen our numbers right now. People are on vacation, they're not even watching. The only people watching right now is our super fans. So, hey, super fans. Thank you for still watching while everybody else is on vacation, including us, by the way. So, I propose for you to make things easy. We're, um, I think since the super fans are watching, we should do something super special. A super summer special. <laughs> You're using the word super a lot. I love super because it reminds me of when we were kids when we had the Super X. I don't Wait. know what was so, so super about it, but anyways. Always been a fan of Superman. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, so what's your plan? My plan is easy peasy. Just run a very special episode. And I think it was, was it in our first year where you did the challenge, the hot pepper. Oh my God. And sour challenge. Oh, that was so, so painful. So when we aired it originally, it was a shortened version, not necessarily edited, but just a shortened version. And all the dude comments and stuff. Yeah. So just run it raw. So folks, super fans, raw footage, raw footage <laughs> of the actual full episode. Have at her, enjoy it, and because this is our treat to you. And once you're done, just head your way uh, out and enjoy the summer like we're going to be doing. But this is a super vacation special for our super fans. All right. See you next Thursday so, for real. Cheers. See you next time. All right. Yeah. See All you right. next time. Kid okay, dude. Oh, 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 dude, dude. Can you, can you pack take, it up? Pack it up and take the cooler and you know where we are. Okay. See you soon. Bye. Saying anything, nothing new to say, talking anyway, stop yammering, can't hear a thing, nothing I can do, so let's have one more brew, one more brew, let's have one more brew, one more brew. Stop talking, try listening, try anything, try whistling, there you go again, saying anything, nothing I can do, so let's have one more brew, one more brew, let's have one more brew, one more brew. Okay, so, tonight's question. Why do teenagers eat Tide Pods and snort condoms? In case what? you haven't heard, I, yeah, there's been a trend recently, it's been snorting condoms. They, they'll unroll the condom and they'll <laughs> snort it. I don't know why. Uh, but a few months ago... Is there ago, anything in the condom? No, I think it's just a condom. I don't know, I haven't tried Just the rubber itself. Yeah, yeah, they snorted up their sign and said, I don't ask why, I, that's the question, why do they do it? Uh, but you surely have heard about the Tide Pod stuff a few Tide months ago. Tide Pod I have. So essentially, uh, these idiots would Oddly eat enough, I have. a Tide Pod, which is essentially detergent, it's, it's poisonous, and just pop in their mouth and, and chew on it and eat it as a challenge. And a lot of them got really sick. I don't know if there's been a fatalities or not, but... 
Oh, the question is, why do they do this stuff? I don't okay, know. Okay, I'm... Why is a massive question. Is this, is this really where we're at now? Okay, so they're essentially eating soap. Yeah. So that's, so, okay. But uh, like a, a, and, a, a really concentrated well, dose. Yeah, of course, it's, yeah. it's big and it's, why? Why is, what's going on in your life? It's, it's not even, this is not even, we're not even talking about somebody trying to take their lives. It's no. merely a challenge. It's like the, the, the ice bucket challenge gone really it's wrong. It's like, remember when we were kids and like, I dare you to stick your tongue on the, the jungle gym in winter? And, and Yeah, but and there's others. It's it's okay. a it's a challenge. Some okay a, a scene in Dumb and Dumber, when they stop off at the truck stop. If you haven't seen Dumb and Dumber, at one point I want to review Dumb and Dumber. We'll, yeah, have, we'll you Dumb Dumb Dumber. Dumber. have you seen Dumb and Dumber? Have you seen Dumb and Dumber? Yes. Okay, so at one point there's the whole scene with the hot peppers when they put the hot peppers in the bad guy's hamburger. Yeah. And then. He dares them to eat a hot pepper. Yeah. And their reaction to that, that's funny. Because he ends up dying, the bad guy, because he has, you know, stomach issues. And he ends up having, instead of being given the proper pills, he's given rat poison. <laughs> Watch the movie. Anyway, I forgot about that scene completely. So there's this whole scene, and that's how, it's one of my favorite scenes because it's so funny. Their reaction is so hilarious. When they eat Dumb and Dumber, eat the hot peppers, that's a challenge. That, that to me would be, that's a challenge. That hot pepper challenge. Not Thai pod, soap pod, stupid snort, snorting stuff. I, wouldn't, I hate when stuff comes out of my nose. Why would I bring stuff in? Anyways, that's a challenge. Are you how challenging do you feel, me? How do you feel about being challenged to a hot pepper challenge i think that was one of my favorite I, scenes i, I thought I like it was spicy, but yeah but people have done that before but yeah i accept your challenge i'll find i'll accept okay I'll, wait 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 so what would, you just said other people have done this well yeah you saw it on dub and dumber and you hear about these well i mean peppers yeah, they, they bring you hotter peppers every freaking year now but I'm sure people have done this before. I'm sure people can YouTube somebody eating the hot pepper. Okay, that's an issue for you. I'll yeah. up it. Challenge up. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Do we want to reveal the challenge now, or do we want to get everything ready? Well, that depends to you. Depends on to you, on you. It depends on you. Because I'm going to up that challenge. Do you want me to prep, and you want to be surprised? Or do you want to be mentally prepared for this? Uh, so now it's really about a question of how many okay, points well, do I get on my man card for this? So what's your usual level of hotness? I, not, I like, not, <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm, I'd like to think of Not beers hot. on a wall hotness, like 1 to 10. I'm talking how much do you... Let's say if, um, if I was going to put hot sauce on a pizza... Uh, Would you be nothing. fine? That's nothing. Like what? We're talking like Frank's Red Hot or something? Fred, eh, that's Frank's, nothing. That's sure. Nothing. Um, if you're going to take hot peppers out of a jar, just eat them like that, how are you with that? I'm not drawn to doing that on its own, but I could handle that, I'm sure. Of course, it depends on the hot pepper. What okay. are we talking here? Are we talking jalapenos? Are we talking habaneros? Are we talking... Okay, I don't know what they're called, but yeah. hotter. I don't know. We're going to go I'm hotter. this way. When I was in Mexico... Um, at one point we did this tour of this, this authentic mine village and they served lunch with the tour and there were like three different sauces and they said there was a red one, a yellow one and a green one. And they said one of them was mild, one of them was pretty hot and one of them they're like, it's really hot, most tourists can't handle that one. And of course, challenge accepted, I put that one on mine and I could tell the mines were like, oh they saw some, a gringo go for it and they're all looking at me like... And it was like, mm, this is good. I went back for more. And they were all like, oh. They didn't, they didn't do this, but I think they would have. Not to brag, golf but, but I, I would say I have a relatively, I'm going to say relatively high threshold for hot. Okay. Because I've never been challenged up here. But, you know, for, for I think my threshold is higher than the average person. So just so you understand, um, 
our show on a regular basis we'll, we'll, we'll be doing different things and I think right now what's happening is that we're presenting one of those elements and one of those elements is oh put me on the spot now actual challenge so if I refuse now I'm a wuss and this episode sucks yeah so you're Pretty gonna much. make me do this because of peer pressure yeah so you want to be surprised or not let's go now all right surprise me surprise all right. me all right we'll be right back I'm gonna surprise him All right, we're back. Okay, here we go. So I, I changed. I figured. All right, sure. Knowing you, this you is know, gonna hurt. If I'm gonna die, this is the shirt to wear. Da 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 da. Star Trek reference. Make sure if you don't get it, start watching Star Trek like right now. The original series. Yeah. <sighs> okay. So in my bucket, 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 bucket of pain. I don't know why I called it. What's that smell? Oh, this we we finished the other beers in the intermission. This is the Broadhead Blueberry Blonde beer. I know it sounds weird you think of blueberries and beer, but seriously, try this beer. It is my favorite summertime beer. I know it's only spring, but it is my favorite summertime beer. It is amaze balls. It smells like Frankenberries. Remember that cereal? Does it still exist? I think they still do have Frankenberries. Oh, no, but it doesn't taste like Frankenberries. It tastes it like beer. Taste, I said it smells like it. Okay, right, anyways. Mm. I feel weird that I'm drinking blueberry beer. It's really good though. Okay, let's focus. Is it good? You're Is trying good? to change the subject. It it's very good. It's there very you good. go. Alright. So, what's the challenge? So, you know what the challenge is. Well, you I said sent you, I sent you all your information. Now you're gonna you're gonna tell people <sighs> all right what you're gonna be consuming here. All right, uh, these are Carolina wow. Reaper peppers. I'm just gonna eat one. Now, in case you don't know, um, peppers are rated their their heat is rated on the Scoville scale and. Uh, a jalapeno pepper, which everybody knows, is between 2,500 to 5,000 Scovilles. Of course. Of course. We all know this. The Carolina Reaper pepper has been tested, and on average, it is 1.569 million Scovilles. The hottest one being registered at over 2.2 million Scovilles. So this makes jalapenos look like water. <laughs> Oh. I hate you right now. The worst part is you also said there was a surprise, and I don't know what the surprise is. <laughs> if this is not surprising enough, the as far as I know, right now in 2018, this is the hottest pepper known to man. Uh, it is. The hybrid built because these do not occur naturally. They had to be crossbred and, and created. And where were they? Uh, oh, yes, yes. A, I, I'd like to send out a, uh, a thank you and a why. <laughs> to Heiko's Hot Sauce. Uh, they're a local Ottawa hot sauce company. And to be honest, I've had some of their sauces already freaking good. You wanna try quality hot sauce, Heiko's Hot Sauce, the website's right there, check it out. Thank you, Heiko. Thank you, Heiko. And I might not thank you after I eat thank this, you, but Heiko. for now, thank you, Heiko. Thank you, Heiko. <laughs> okay, so, the hot pepper thing wasn't enough. Cause it's been done. Lots of times. Apparently. Hundreds, thousands of times. Hot pepper challenges have been... But, here's the thing. I decided to add the one component, the one thing that I am unable to do. The one thing that I can't stomach or mouth or I can't stand is... Oh, shut up! The Warheads. Have you had these before? <laughs> I hate you right now. I hate. If you don't know what a Warhead is, it's a. Other people ex- love these just because of the experience. But go ahead. It's an extreme sour candy. So it's sour Damn. beyond belief. I Your face just puckers like crazy. Sour. So I'm going to have super hot and super sour at the same time. I hate you. <laughs> Why am I going to. So. So what's the bucket for? The bucket 
is to ensure that if there's any issues, it goes in the bucket, not on our lazy boys. Protect the lazy boy. I hate you right now. You know now. what's funny though? Oh, of all the possible beers in the world, you have to pick a blueberry beer to go with hot peppers and a warhead. I'm peeling, here. In the, no, I'm not going to put it in the bucket. If I had to pick up warhead wrapper out of puke, I'm not going to do it. So, we are middle-aged men. We are not going through a midlife crisis. We are just exploring uh, different facets of life that we used to do on a regular basis. Who the hell explores and, us? And no, we didn't get a ch we don't get a chance to do very often, well, as in myself why are we challenging doing this again? my friend into doing completely idiotic, but it's actual food. Oh, this that's right, the Tide Pods. Exist. Okay. This is, pop peppers are a thing, they are edible. I'm not sure if that one specifically is edible. But here we go. So red with red. Oh. So how do you want to do this? You want a countdown? I yeah. Uh, here, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm I'm gonna pop the pepper first, take a few bites, and then pop the sour one in, and then so hopefully. The, are, are, are you are you comfortable with the fact that this is strictly for bragging rights? Well, you're gonna have it. You're gonna have it on. on it's it's video. preserved for posterity. It's well, sir, it's it's bragging rights, but at the same time, it'll probably be public humiliation because I'm I'm assuming I will not be all like, yeah, that was tasty. Uh, <laughs> God, why am I doing this? All right, <laughs> I just dared you, and you're still doing it. See, that's how close we are. I hate you. I, I can I can dare him to do something, yeah. and he feels compelled to oh, do it. Payback is gonna be a bitch. Okay. <sighs> yeah, wait. give me a countdown, give me a countdown. Oh, I have to take, I don't want to drink while you're doing that because I know it's going to, I'm seeing issues. It's gonna, you think you're going to laugh that I'm hard? I'm going to laugh that hard. <laughs> okay. You want to uh, drink first? No, no, no my hands are full. Food? No, no, I'll keep the drink for after to wash away the spicy. Okay. Piece. So, are you ready to count down with me? So, what are you eating again? Can you please elaborate one more time? Carolina Reaper pepper, as far as I know, the hottest pepper in the world. And Warhead's Extreme Sour Candy, one of the most sour things you can pop in your my mouth. mouth. <laughs> I'm having issues with my <laughs> mouth now. <laughs> uh, okay, so, yes. Give me a countdown already. <laughs> the anticipation okay, so, is killing me. Are you ready for this? Uh, are you ready for this? No, but do it anyways. Wait, I'm gonna do I'll three, never be two, ready, one, just do it. Three, two, one, go. Not three, two, one, just three, two, one, and then go. You ready for this? Yes. Three. <laughs> two. Get faster! No. One. Go! Oh my god, this is go. Oh. 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 again next week. Ciao for now. Okay. We're back. I went. It was horrendous. I feel 
super bad. <sighs> that was a horrendous thing. Don't do that. <sighs> sniff a condom before you do that. <sighs> Seriously, sniff a condom. <sighs> I can't believe I'm saying that, but it was a horrible thing. We just went through a lot of milk, a lot of sugar. It was really, I thought I had to call 911, and I'm not kidding about this. Do not do this at home. I hate you. Do not do this at home. Man, I, I feel horrible. That was really funny at that point. It's not so funny right now. It might get funny again later on, but it's not funny at this point. That was really bad. Uh, you, uh, uh, how, oh my god, how horrendous was that? Because you're still going through it right now. Uh, uh, this is not. Uh, uh, fuck it. Uh, uh, my family's going to think I'm the biggest idiot ever. And right now I would agree with them. Do not. Uh, do not pop a hole. Carolina Reaper pepper in your mouth. Uh, and add a sour head. No, no, a war head, I mean. No. I don't even want to touch it. Don't, don't try this. <laughs> you're gonna pay. Next challenge. Oh, oh, oh you're what? gonna. Yeah. There's no, 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 there wasn't an exchange thing. You're wussing out? No, no, I didn't say I was wussing out. Hand I, over the man I card. I said uh, I was wussing out. Hand over the man card. I wouldn't say I was, uh, I wouldn't say I was wussing uh, out. Uh, oh, yeah. So this was ridiculous. Uh, I went overboard. I apologize. It was funny though, right? It was funny. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's one of those things where somebody falls and it's funny and then you make sure they're okay and if they need first date and then it becomes funny again, this it's, is funny again. It's funny because it's not you. <laughs> right now, I'm, I'm gonna- I have to go buy more milk. Oh, poor baby. I'm yeah, that was uh, bad. No, I, seriously, I felt really I'm bad. I've got to be going to the bathroom bad. and wiping my butt for hours now. I felt bad. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, that funny? Yeah, it was funny. But uh, I felt really bad at one point. Okay. No. And no. now I just want to make sure you're okay. Uh, I'll live. I'll live. Uh, uh, that was intense. Uh, I thought we were done. I'm just glad the camera wasn't upstairs. No, I'd be kind of kitchen. embarrassing. That would be very that was embarrassing. embarrassing. That I was like, yeah. I, I'm, I, I, I'm not too ashamed to admit I cried. Oh, oh, <laughs> I'm still crying a little bit. <laughs> Just to be clear, <laughs> we are two middle-aged men doing stupid stuff. Not all the time. This is not what we're about. It will happen. It will. Are you gonna? Are you okay, dude? You okay? All right. See you later.